the third Frontiers Annual Chief Editor Summit. We're starting with the awards ceremony uh, for the first annual 2017 Frontiers Spotlight Award. Science is really what's moving this planet. It has been doing so over the past 200 years now at an even accelerated space. And humanity is facing really serious challenges. We have to feed uh, 10 billion people by 2050. And right at, at this moment, we don't have a clue how we're going to do that. We live in a world which needs to develop a low carbon future, a low carbon economy. And environmental science is the underpins all of those issues and so be able to translate environmental science to places outside of academia is critical. Now we're having a lot of issues dealing with sustainability, with lack of fertility in soils, uh, with loss of biodiversity so I think right now we need to start working towards other goals which are to uh, make plants more nutritious. How do we balance uh, the needs of, for humans for water? both for human needs and for the environment. So sustainable water management is currently one of our major challenges and in 20 years it'll be an even bigger challenge. I see the future as being more preventive. Developing sensors, biomarkers, we also have a pool of genetics uh, uh, instruments that we can really use to predict what may happen in five years, 10 years, 20 years, it even may be longer. The obesity and diabetes epidemic threaten to uh, overtake all of our health systems in the, the, how much it's costing to treat obesity and diabetes. There's no adequate solutions that have yet uh, appeared that uh, make any real sense. Open science has a particularly important role to play because up until now I don't think we have really uh, been good at getting our message that's research based to our general communities. As it is now, the general public is not able to go to the sources because the sources are all hidden behind these paywalls. It's about us all pulling together to solve this very big problem about how are we going to take the scientific knowledge, scientific data, and leverage this in the most effective way possible to solve the problems that we're, we're all confronted with. I mean, it's, it's a very, very inspiring moment for me.